Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how you can connect DaVinci Resolve to your YouTube account so that you can upload videos straight from within DaVinci Resolve. So first you need to go up to the DaVinci Resolve menu, go down to Preferences, and then there's going to be Internet Accounts here. Under Internet Accounts, you can sign into YouTube. Note also Vimeo is another platform you can publish to with the same method. So let's go ahead and sign in here. So when you hit sign in, you're going to get your Google prompt. So go ahead and put in the email that's associated with your YouTube account, the email that you log in in order to access that account. So when you're selecting which account to use, make sure that you choose your YouTube channel and not your email. So when you hit accept, you should see signed in as for YouTube. And you'll note here that it doesn't show up here as an email address for me, but rather a Google Plus account. So if you see an email, it might not be correct and you might need to sign out and make sure that you select the YouTube channel, not the email. So when your project is finished and you're ready to upload it, go over to your Deliver tab. And when you're here, you are going to want to select YouTube from the render settings. So you can click on the drop down if you need to change the resolution to something lower or higher than 180p. Give it a file name for the storage of the video on your computer. So I might call this YouTube upload test. The settings below you can customize as needed. So if you need a different frame rate, you can go ahead and do that. Format will work usually perfectly fine for MP4 or QuickTime, so no worries there. And unless you have other settings to change, you can come down here to the YouTube section. So upload directly to YouTube will be checked by default when you connect to your YouTube account in Resolve. So leave that checked if you want it to upload automatically. And here we have the ability to write a description. So this is the description that's going to go in your YouTube video. So I can just write test upload here. If you wanted to, you can copy and paste your default description on your YouTube channel into this box here, or you can later edit it after it gets uploaded onto YouTube, which is probably what I would do. So visibility will be set to private by default. This will make it so that no one can see the video but you. So if you think you might need to edit some things about it, like add in cards or change the description before you publish, you can leave it as private. But if you do want to immediately publish it, you can go public. Or if you want it to be only accessible with, by people with a link, you can choose unlisted. As well, you can select the category here. So for me, that would probably be more like how to and style. So we'll go ahead and add this to the render queue and publish it. So start render is going to save it to the file and afterwards it'll immediately upload. So we can see here the upload upload complete if everything was done correctly. And now if you go ahead and check the YouTube back end, you should see your video as the most recently uploaded and you can go ahead into the edit phase change the thumbnail, add a description, publish it, whatever else you need to. So that's in a nutshell how you can use DaVinci Resolve with YouTube to immediately upload your videos after you publish them to a file. So I've been Chris, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in my future video content.